Hey everyone, welcome back to Global Military Forum. Today, we're diving deep into the world of unmanned combat aerial vehicles, or UCAVs, with a focus on a game changer from Turkey, the Bayraktar Kizilelma PT-3. Get ready, because this isn't just another drone. It's a revolutionary step toward the future of aerial warfare. What is the Bayraktar Kizilelma PT-3? Developed by Baykar, the Turkish defense firm known for its innovative UCAVs, the Kizilelma P-3 is the latest iteration of Turkey's ambitious program to produce stealthy, next-gen unmanned combat vehicles. But what makes the PT-3 stand out from its predecessors? The PT-3 isn't just designed to look sleek, its low radar cross-section gives it a stealth profile that can slip past enemy radars, allowing it to perform deep strikes in contested airspace. And it's not just about flying unnoticed. This drone is also built to dogfight. Imagine a future where drones, not human pilots, are executing aerial combat maneuvers. The PT-3 is equipped with advanced sensors, AI-driven decision-making, and high-speed agility to handle air-to-air -air and air-to-ground missions. But that's not all. The Kizilelma PT-3 boasts state-of-the-art avionics, a multi-role radar, and a modular payload system capable of carrying a wide range of munitions, from precision-guided bombs to air-to-air -air missiles. Its autonomous operation capabilities mean it can make split-second decisions in combat without waiting for a human operator to give the go-ahead. Why should we care about the Kizilelma PT-3? Well, this drone represents a significant leap in military technology, potentially shifting the balance in aerial warfare. It's not just a surveillance drone, it's a versatile combat system designed for the modern battlefield. With its capabilities, it could change how air superiority is achieved and maintained. Could we see drone-on-drone -drone dogfights dominating the skies? Could the Kaizi Lelma PT-3 set the stage for a new era of combat where human pilots become a thing of the past? Only time will tell. Let us know in the comments, do you think the Kizilelma PT-3 is the future of aerial warfare, or is it just another step on a much longer road?